Greetings everyone. Manu Patra brings to you the news highlights of 3 February 2023. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court while observing that the word within used for CRZ1 and the word in used for CRZ2 in the CRZ notification of 2011 cannot be interpreted to include what is outside the port areas has held that storage facility for edible oil is not allowed outside port area. The honorable court in a plea by a 21-year-old unmarried woman seeking permission to terminate a 29-week pregnancy has allowed the adoption of the child by the prospective parents whose details were set out in the Central Adoption Resource Authority registration form. The Supreme Court has held that high courts cannot override and impose their will on the parties if parties to a litigation proceeding have entered into an agreement to compound a compoundable offence. The Supreme Court has issued guidelines on the issue of under trial prisoners who continue to be in custody despite having been granted the benefit of bail on account of their inability to fulfill the conditions stipulated in the bail order or otherwise. News highlights from the high courts. The Kerala High Court has directed the state that properties of those persons who have no connection with the popular front of India and which were erroneously attached by the authorities have to be released to them by lifting the attachment of the properties. The Calcutta High Court has upheld the life sentence awarded to a Pakistani national belonging to the terrorist organization Al Badr who was found to have entered Indian territory illegally through Bangladesh and was proceeding to Srinagar, Jammu and Kashmir for the purpose of carrying out terrorist activities. This concludes the news for today. Thank you so much.